Oh, it feels good to have the wind in your face. Nothing like it. 50 degrees out here, skiing on Snowmass Mountain. Can't let you have one leg slow you down. Well, I, I have a prosthesis myself, so when I was growing up, I uh, was raised on a wooden leg. And uh, I've always been able to do a lot of stuff and get out and realize that even though you had a prosthetic and you know a handicap of any sort, you can still enjoy life and get down the mountains or you know enjoy doing what everyone else is doing. And I, I just wanted to let people know that you know they may come back and have an injury or have a prosthetic, but I just wanted to be an example to show that they can still have fun, have a fulfilling life, and have not let it stop them from getting out and skiing and doing fun stuff. Don't make me give you a ticket out there, Fred. I am a fake cop. Fred ain't kidding, man. I can't catch up to him. Fred, you're a speed demon. Slow it down, buddy. Slow it down. You know how fast you're going? You know how fast you're going? You know, a lot of people I talked to said they didn't ever think that they could do it. They never thought, I know, I can't get in a mountain and go skiing. I'm in a wheelchair or I have a prosthesis. And then they see this program and they see other people doing it. They say, wait a minute, those guys are doing that. I can get out and do it. And so it's really important, I think, to show as an example of what it's like to be able to get out here and have the freedom to be on a mountain and go down and feel that wind in your face and the excitement and the thrill. Thank you, guys, for everything. And now, we will clear up the slope. All right, meow. Should we take, take down the slopes? Just take down the yeah. You got no. some, uh, go get some shenanigans? <laughs> yeah. You know, I just have so much uh, respect and admiration for all the sacrifices that the veterans have made to keep us safe and allow us to have the freedoms that we love so much. So. It's the smallest thing I can do is come back and just tell some funny stories of overcoming adversity and hopefully trying to inspire them to keep coming down the mountain. <laughs>